Hello, my name is Walter Unglob, and this is How Do Fibonacci Retracements Work? A Fibonacci retracement is an analytical method for trying to calculate and predict by how much the price of a security will change over time and in what direction. So this process tends to be somewhat sto stochastic, meaning it's you can't really predict exactly where it will go, certainly not analytically because it's usually due to a complex system in the market. So the way this works is you would take two extreme points over some period of time, and you're interested in the vertical distance between these two extreme points and the price of the security. It could be a stock, for example. And you divide this vertical distance by the key Fibonacci ratios. So the reason this is called a Fibonacci retracement is because it's based off of the famous mathematical sequence, the Fibonacci sequence. And the key Fibonacci ratios are determined by taking the golden ratio, which is equal to one plus the square root of five divided by two, and raising it to different powers. So the key Fibonacci ratios are going to be the golden ratio raised to the zero power, the negative one power, the negative two power, negative three, and negative infinity. So when we raise the golden ratio to the power zero, of course we just get one. So that's going to be 100%. Next, we can calculate f sub negative 1, which is going to be the same number, the golden ratio, raised to the negative 1 power, so 1 over the golden ratio. And that's going to be approximately equal to 0 0.618, or 61.8%. Likewise, we use the same formula, and f sub negative 2 is going to be equal approximately to 0.382, or 38.2%. f sub negative 3 is going to be equal to 0 0.236, or 23.6%. And finally, f sub negative infinity will be equal to the golden ratio raised to the negative infinity power, which of course is just equal to zero, because one over infinity, as you approach infinity, you ultimately get zero. So what do you do with these key ratios? Well, you take a look at this vertical distance that you found by determining the two extreme points in your time series and you draw horizontal lines going from 0% to 100%. So that takes care of two of these ratios. And then you just draw horizontal lines corresponding to these three intermediary ratios. One at the 23.6%, one at the 38.2%, and then finally one at 61.8%. And you can also have a 50% if you like to gauge how the price of the security is doing. So once you've done that, you can use this as a tool for determining what's called a support or resistance level. And the point behind support and resistance levels is to determine more or less how far a price will increase to a certain level or decrease to a certain level. And this is essentially how Fibonacci retracements work to begin with. My name is Walter Unglob, and this is How Do Fibonacci Retracements Work?